Hey everyone, welcome back to my bike channel. Today I'm back in my bike shed and I'm also back from Germany. I hope you had an absolute marvellous Sorry, Christmas. Sure oh, shut up! The mic's off. Hey, let's start again. Right, welcome back to my bike shed. Today I want to show you something I had delivered during the time I was in Germany. So it will be a very short video, but check this out. My first unboxing video. Right, first of all we have this one here. Good old trusted knife. Let's see what that thing is. That knife is so sharp, I want to really be very careful not to destroy anything what's there. Let's have a look. Oh yes, this is... Oh, no idea who sent me that. But that is pretty cool. That's a... LED headlight assembly for Hermon. So have to put that in. Excellent. And I give that a truly good check. I've seen these on some of the forums, but to be honest, I never ever came across one of them in situ. So righty ho. Excited whoever sent me that. Thank you very much. Let's just put that away. That was unexpected. <clears throat> However, the next item, I absolutely know about it. So, <clears throat> I ordered that a couple of months ago, to be honest because I was rather intrigued. Hold on, come on, here we go. Right, I was rather intrigued by the whole concept. Let's just get that thing out. Right, what it is, it is the Wingman Goose. So guys, you may ask, what is this all about with that wingman goose? Well, I assume you've seen the videos. I put a link in the description below. It's basically a one-man hand, a tiny little, tiny little thing. It's made out of um, proper old-fashioned style wax tent material. So it's an all-in-one solution. So it's more or less like the Australian swag, just with a tent added to it. So it's quite interesting. When you go to their website, check it out. They have a YouTube video and it's a bit, you know, trendy guy with beard working in a cafe, gets on his motorbike, straps that baby on, rides for a few hours, goes on the beach, ocean, sand and sun. And yeah, has a jolly good time, chills out. Next day, rolls it all up puts it back on his motorbike and goes back to work and he's the cool dude. So, obviously, not sure if that works, but as you all know, I also have, other than my GS, I have here, my good old trusty Harley Davidson 48, ready to go. And I mean ready to go because I want to do this thing in the winter. Apparently they told me on the website that all you have to do is put a sleeping bag liner into the swag and you are warm as toast. Well, we find out. So what I will do is, hold on, let's just change the camera angle. Here we go. The idea is, let's put that away. Strap that thing to your motorbike as it is and you've got everything 
for your little short camping trip. Now that's all nice and good. Apart from I'm not in California, that's Britain. It's cold, it's wet and it's horrible. When I travel I have my helmet with, you, with me and my motorbike gear so I have no idea how I store that. But I will reenact that beautiful video and then, you know, we find out if that thing matches up. Now, the idea and the concept, I think it's actually great. Because sometimes you just want to grab your motorbike with all big faffing around, you go for a ride, you're not taking much camping gear with you. And I think the idea of having like an all-in-one solution, I think it's pretty smart, really. I mean, the Aussie sussed it out. So the question is just how that translate into the situation here in the UK. So the way I look at it, it needs to be tested and I'm your guinea pig and I will let you know how I get on with it. So that's all about that surprise here with my new tent. I think it would be mega fun to find it out, how it goes and well, I'm absolutely sure you will follow me on my way. Guys, that's it for this little short video today. I will do some more stuff now. Today is the 30th of December, so tomorrow is New Year's Eve. So again, family business. But then I jump into action and I want to do some more stuff around um, here in the bike shed and go for a ride. There's a few things I want to discuss with you anyway. All the changes I do for my new camping gear. So there is definitely you no know, cookware is essential, new knives and stuff like that. Because next year I want to do a, a nice long three week trip. Um, then I have to upgrade obviously that light fitting I have. The cameras have to go on it. So there's plenty to do and obviously I want to carry you along. And as usual give you my absolute 100% honest unbiased opinion so i think that's it for the day very quick video guys listen if we don't speak tomorrow well i think we don't have an absolute marvelous new year and i wish you all the very best safe riding whatever you do keep your head off the asphalt and make sure you always come back in one piece until next time guys ride safe